it's not your normal chicken parm. I mean, obviously we're Italian and we and there's certain foods that we like in our life. And I really believe that we need to enjoy our food. Right? I think in, in the fitness world, everyone's under the assumption that they have to eat steamed chicken and rice. And I want our food to be powerful, colorful and delicious. And uh, the rest will take care of itself. Those are great words. Go for it. All right, cool. We're going to just start with a basic, you know, chicken breast. We're going to pound this out according to how thin you want it. I mean, the breast is pretty much going to come out to looking about like this. And at that point, we have some basic ingredients here, salt, pepper, uh, white uh, rice flour or brown rice flour, because I prefer to keep things a bit gluten-free, especially if you're gluten intolerant. Uh, we have our quinoa flakes. We have our... Um, um, our grounded flax, which is great for omegas, anti-inflammatories, um, and we have our nutritional yeast. And then we're going to top it off with some olive oil. We're going to air fry it because, you know, me being a, a, a parent of two, I want to just throw it in somewhere and leave it and have a little bit of that crispness, a little bit of that crunch. So let's start adding all three of those ingredients in. Right. We're gonna, Tommy and I are going to team up right now. We're going to have a little bit of fun. Uh, we're going to get everyone involved here. Cracking the egg, this is uh, fast and efficient. Nutritional yeast, guys, if, if you don't use it a lot, that is um, the ingredient that mimics gra grated cheese. So grated Parmigiano or grated Parmesan or grated uh, Pecorino. That's what's mimicking that in, in the dish. And you're getting your, instead of a breadcrumb, uh, these guys are using the quinoa flakes. So you, you're getting a really dense, uh, in nutrition and high in protein this year um, with not a lot of effort. Yeah, and what's great is exactly what you said. This does not take effort. You throw things in literally three bowls. You get your hands a little dirty. It could be a family affair. You pat the toppings right on like that. And I mean, this couldn't be easier. Eating healthy does not have to be difficult. And that's what I love about the recipes that Don shows, um, shows me and, and has taught me is, is they're delicious. How often do you guys get to cook together? Not enough. Not enough, Aww. but um, I think I, I show up at his house sometimes and say, let's go. And he's like, uh, did I ask you to be here? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now, Don, what are you doing? So just basing a little bit of olive oil on the chicken breast. Mm -hmm. We're going to throw it now into the air fryer. We have one going over here to show a little bit of a finished product. It's going to get a little messy. We're going to have some fun with it. We're going to close out. We're going to hit start. Amazing. And then we're going to want to throw some greens on the side. I like making sure the dishes are powerful. If you're really feeling Italian here and you want to throw a little pasta on it, I would recommend a little you know, brown rice pasta, a little bit of gluten-free pasta. My wife, who likes to eat uh, a little less clean than I do, she will definitely throw some mozzarella on it, which I think if you're into it, do it. Have some fun. The idea is to enjoy your food, making some different choices, using some healthier, more powerful ingredients are going to go a long way for you. Check this out. This is the finished, beautiful plate. Oh, it's gorgeous. I'm, I'm going in. I'm going in. This Take is a bite, bite for you, Rach, all right? It looks gorgeous. Nice and crunchy. And what did you do mm. for the red sauce? Tomato basil? What, what's yeah, the sauce, Yeah, just the basic guys? tomato basil. Sometimes I get lazy and I just go for a canned tomato sauce. I'm sorry to admit that. But, you know, I'm, I'm, I need things that are quick, that are on the go. That's okay. It works. That's delicious. This is unbelievable, Rach. I wish you could try it. One of your faves, right, babe? One of uh, my Tommy. favorites. He, he, he never steers me wrong. <laughs>